I'm just gonna hope and pray for the best. How much does a focus blast do to me? Let's just go for the Draco Meteor. Oh my god. It took... Okay, we're five minutes into this. We're not even five minutes into this episode. That's fantastic. I'm gonna build a team. We'll be right back. And uh, let's try and not get our asses handed to us this time around. That took a lot longer than I was expecting. So, fun fact... I recorded that last part on Tuesday, uh, Wednesday. Um, I have, let's see, it's 10.50. I work early tomorrow, so we're going to try and beat all five Elite Four members uh, all in this one sitting. So I don't know how this is going to go, but before we do anything, we're going to do a quick little team recap, or well, an introduction to our new team. Uh, I have some items to give to everybody, but... Yeah, this is our team. Starting off, we've got Lois, followed by Slasher, Paula, Bells, Cassidy, and PC God. So, that is our squad. I have a handful of items to give to everybody. Um, this is mainly what took me as long as it did. So, uh, first off, I'm going to teach Fly to Cassidy. Then, we're going to buy some more potions and try not to scream. So, yeah, this is going to be fun. This is going to be really fun. I can't wait to see how this episode is going to go. But, starting off, we've got a Black Sludge for Cassidy. We've got a Life Orb for Paula. We've got a Choice Band for PC God. We've got a Scizorite for Slasher. And then, last but not least, we've got two Lefties for my boys Lois and Bells. So, yeah, took me a lot longer to find those than I was anticipating. I've got some elixirs, so we should be fine in that aspect. I'm going to buy as many more full or max potions as I can with my insufficient amount of funds. Uh, we're going to go with 33. Actually, no, I'm going to get myself to 60. Nope, that's the wrong buttons. I, that's not what I want. Oh, my lord. I'm going to scream. This is going well. So there we go. Full restore, get you to 60. You, get you to 60. All right, so in that case, we're just gonna jump straight into this. Um, my game plan for this first battle, for this battle against Sydney, I'm just gonna set up, I'm gonna mega, I'm gonna set up, and I'm gonna try to take out Sydney's entire team. Except for the Absol, because the Absol has Fire Blast. And I'm not playing that game at all i'm gonna take out the rest of his team then i'm just gonna switch into pc god and i'm just gonna i don't know brick break it or close combat whichever move i have and just murder it so that's my game plan i think it's gonna go swimmingly and uh yeah i'm gonna just set up because uh i'm super effective against everything but the Scrafty, and if it gets, if it attacks first, the Greninja. Because the Greninja will probably go for Hydro Pump, uh, activate Protean, and that'll change it to a pure water type. So, other than that, we probably take out most of both Sydney and Phoebe's Mons with Slasher. However, Slasher is going to have to deal, uh, He's, Slash is going to have to switch out for both the Mega Absol and the Chandelure. So, other than that, Slasher just takes care of business. Like, completely. For these first two Elite Four members. And honestly, even Glacia. Because, in theory, I could probably stay in with Slasher and take out the Mega Glalie uh, with Iron Head. So, yeah, this is going to be an experience. We're going to try, we're trying to take out four Elite Four members in i don't know less than 30 minutes last episode or the last half of or the last part of this episode was like 10 minutes almost so yeah i'm trying to make this episode not drag on but it probably en is gonna end up doing that um i don't know if slasher outspeeds absol so i'm not gonna risk it and stay in because the last thing I need is Slasher dying against the first Elite Four member. Because the last time I lost my big red button to the first Elite Four member, 
I then proceeded to get my shit wrecked. So I'm a little I'm honestly I'm more mad that um I'm more mad that Phoebe was like zero problem for me, just for me to then go in against Glacia and she just, you know, decides that she's gonna shit on me entirely and take out my two probably most important mons I could have had for what was left of the Elite Four. So I'm a little mad about that, but overall, Sydney's just gonna get destroyed. And again, probably Phoebe as well. Uh but Phoebe Phoebe can easily send in her uh her Pokemon to take care of uh Scizor faster than Sydney will. Because the Elite Four is basically meant to not throw in their last Mon. And since Absol's literally his only Mon that has a um, super effective move on, on Slasher. Oh my god. Okay. This is not the game I want to be playing for myself. Nope. Alright. So I'm going to heal up. Just because I should. So Bisharp's coming out. I'm going to use my mouse just in case. Because every time I do anything else, I misclick and heal the wrong mom. And I don't want that happening right now. Sucker Punch. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'm just going to go for the X Scissor. And there goes Bisharp. Oh, no, nope, you have a Focus Slash. Sash. I can't speak words. And of course you paralyze me. That's fine. I'm going to just full heal. Because he's going to heal this turn. And there's honestly no reason for me to do otherwise. Because I could kill it, but I also don't want to be parried. It's not worth it. Uh, not that I, like, again, not that I'm going to stay in against the Absol, because if the Absol outspeeds me by any chance, and it lands a Fire Blast, I am 100% dead. There's no way I'm surviving. So, Absol, it's your time to shine, which means I'm going to switch out into... I can either go into Paula or I can go into PC God. But on the off chance it has a Fairy-type move, I'm going to go into PC God. Because it might have Extra Sensory or Psychic, but... I think I'm not, I don't think I'm too afraid of that. I think I'm confident in a close combat one-shotting this thing. Well, it's going to definitely one-shot this thing. So, and I'm choice banded, so. And I outspeed it, perfect. All right, bye, Absol. <laughs> oh my god, that was insane. Okay, well, that went pretty well. Look at that, it only took us seven minutes. We've already taken out the first member of the Elite Four faster than we did last time around. Then again, I'm speeding up, so. I guess there's that. Um, I don't remember what Phoebe starts off with. But if I do remember correctly, it is not the Chandelure. I think Chandelure was the second to last Pokemon she used. So either she'll use it immediately after I take out her first Mon or she'll still wait. If she still waits, that's fine. Again, I'm not going to stay out because I don't want to risk being outsped. But I'm pretty confident that Slasher can once again just take care of business. For the most part, at least. And honestly, everyone I have as backup can also take care of business. So I don't really have too many fears of this gym or this Elite Four member. Like Phoebe, Phoebe caused the least amount of damage for me. She didn't take out a single one of my Pokemon. Sydney at least took out one, and it was from a crit, so it was bullshit. And I, I guess technically Glacia did the same thing. Miss Magius, okay, that's fine. Miss Magius definitely doesn't know a, fi a fire type move, and if she does, I'm gonna scream. She doesn't learn fire type moves. I know that. I should know that. I don't know. I'm just gonna go for the same method I did last time and just swords dance. I'm probably only gonna plus. I'm gonna plus two again, just because honestly, plus three is a little unnecessary. Of course she outspeeds me, and of course she goes for T-Wave. How many of these Elite Four members have Thunder Wave on their Pokemon? Like, do they all have one Pokemon with Thunder Wave? Because if so, that's terrible. Shadow Ball doesn't really do too much. Of course my Special Defense goes down, though. And of course... Um, I'm going to just go for the Night Slash, because I'll live another one. Barely, but I'll live it. And Night Slash might kill here. It does, You're a Fairy-type in this game. Okay. I'm leaving. I'm gonna skadoodle into... Is Cassidy my best choice? 141... 155... 
But you might have a psychic type move, which actually, now that I think about it, is really bad for me. I'm going to switch into Cassidy. Uh, I'm definitely going to outspeed. There's no way that Cassidy is not outspeeding this Miss Magius. She's going to full restore. Okay, that's fine. Um, I can either heal or I can... I'm going to Confuse Ray. Just, just for the chance of it hitting itself. Because that'll be nice. Hit yourself. Or you can just not hit yourself and then break out next turn. That's exactly what I thought was going to happen. So, that's fine. All right. This uh, Miss Magius is going to piss me off to no end. There's no way I had this. I, I, I had zero problems with this Miss Magius last time around. So, hit yourself. Thank you. That is fantastic. I'm not going to keep this uh, paralysis on because all I can really do is uh, fly. And I'm not going to risk getting paired one of the two turns that I manage. Okay, Thunderbolt. You know what? That's fine. That's acceptable. Okay, you know what? That's fine. I'm going to switch out. I'm going to go and do... I mean, if you only have Thunderbolt... So, Thunder Wave, Thunderbolt, Shadow Ball. Your last move is probably Psychic. Uh, a Psychic-type move. So, I'm going to go back into Slasher. I'm going to assume she's going to go for Thunder Wave again. And I'm just going to... Hit yourself, actually. That'd be fantastic. Nope, okay. This Miss Magius is pissing me off. You are pushing my buttons, Miss Magius. You are playing a tough game. Night Slash is all I can do. Please don't lower my special defense again. Turn one. Thank you. All right. Night Slash isn't going to do that much. That's fine. I'm going to Night Slash again. I don't want to. I don't want to be playing games with this Miss Magius. There are better Pokemon on her team for me to set up against, but I really want her to bring out that Chandelure. That would be the ideal circumstance for me. She doesn't bring it out. Interesting. All right. I mean, I can definitely set up against the score guys. I forgot how big the score guys is. That's a big boy. I'm going to full restore because you shouldn't have any fire type moves because why would you? You're a grass type. So I don't know. <laughs> can I run? <laughs> can I leave? Why? There's no reason. If he had landed that, I would have for sure died. Why? Why do you have that? Okay, I'm going to win the PC God. Why does it have Fire Blast? <laughs> what what world am I living in? Fire Blast, get the hell out of here, you piece of shit. I'm going for Fire Punch. Get the hell out of my face. You're dead. I'm Iron Fist. You're I'm folk. I'm Choice Banded. Like there's no living. Go away. Good lord. Okay. Dusknor. Um, I feel like there's a good reason you're going into Dusknor. And it's probably not a good one. So I'm just gonna go for another Fire Punch. I feel like you have something that can hurt me. You're burned. Well, that's fantastic. Earthquake, that's what you had. Well, I'm glad I got the burn. That was a crit. Okay. I was about to say there's no way in hell that Earthquake just did that much damage while it's burned. Okay. Whew. I gotta be careful. Because if I... One misclick and I'm fucked. I, I knew she was gonna full restore that turn. But if I had misclicked and she attacked, I would have been screwed. Can I get another burn? I just realized I... Ooh. That's gonna hurt. <sighs> I'm so dumb. I can't believe I just did that. I knew I only lived... Because of the burn. That burn cut its it cut it in half, so it wasn't super effective. Wow, I did a really good job picking these teams, dude. I'll tell you what. All right, this motherfucker definitely has fire punch. I'm doing a terrible job, not dying. Fifty-seven. I don't know how fast this Dusknor is, but I definitely don't think he's faster than Cassidy. So... I am throwing, dude. I am throwing. I am absolutely throwing 
right now. She withdrew. Into what? Into the Chandelure. Why? What does the Chandelure have that can hurt? Okay. Okay. You know what? I, I don't know what to say. I get in here, you know, I'm so confident, and then because and I and then I attack a Pokemon I knew would kill me, unless I got that burn. Why am I having more problems right now against her than I did last time around? Okay, it did 130. I need to go into Lois. Lois, you can eat a th you can eat a you can eat a Shadow Ball. You're fine. You'll be fine. I'm pulling- I'm making the dumbest choices. I'm making the- I made- I just made the dumbest mistake I could have possibly made in that situation. Because I'm like, getting- I'm getting- I'm getting a- that's like, this is my problem. So I get like, annoyed, and then my brain just stops, like, all common sense is just out the window from that point on. And common sense would have been to switch out of PC God. And now PZ God's dead. So, that was an unnecessary death, too. That's what's more annoying. <laughs> Alright. Um, the Chandelure's dead. This thing still probably has Fire Punch. I'm confident that I'll outspeed it. And that's probably not gonna end up being... Okay, that's fine. Night Slash kills. All she has left is the Sableye. If there is any world where this Sableye has a Fire-type move, I might scream. She has the Gengar. Okay, I forgot about the Gengar, actually. I'll be honest. I think a Night Slash will just kill you, though. Out Focus Blast, I, out I miss. And Night Slash, okay. I'm a little disappointed in myself. I'm a little dis I'm gonna be honest. I'm a little disappointed in myself that PC God just died for such a dumb reason that I could have prevented. But... Because I wasn't thinking straight, and I was too busy mashing buttons, I didn't think about the fact that that Dusknor's Earthquake was going to kill me. Of course, you have Prankster. Ooh, I'm gonna kill this motherfucker. That does nothing. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'm gonna heal up. I'm gonna have to wait for it to miss a Will-O-Wisp. Because Prankster is just gonna, it's gonna just hit all of its attacks first. It's just gonna have priority. I'm gonna go for Swords Dance. You didn't go for Willow Wisp. Interesting. Yes, you did. Why did I go first then? Shouldn't Prankster have. How does Prankster work? Isn't Prankster. What do I have? Technician. I still have Technician. Why did Prankster. Why did it go second? Doesn't Prank. Does Prankster not work the way I thought it did? My my camera's unfocused. Thank you. Does Prankster not work the way I thought it did? Doesn't Prankster make its, its like, all status attacks go first? Metal Burst. What the fuck is this thing doing? I'm so confused. I thought Sableye had Prankster. Does Mega Sableye not have Prankster? What does Mega Sableye have? What's your ability? Mega... Mega Sableye, what do you have? You have Prankster, don't you? Isn't that what your ability is when you're Mega? I don't know. I don't know what's going on right now. Magic Bounce. That's what it has. Oh, well then... So regular Sableye has Prankster. That makes sense. Alright, well... That's why, it, that's why it affected the first turn. The first turn... I, I'm pretty sure how... How... The abilities work, which is weird, is that the turn the Pokemon Megas, it still uses the ability it had before. I think. I could be wrong. I don't know. But here we are, uh, making our way against Glacia. We're down one Mon already. It took all of five minutes. And it's because I made a dumb mistake. So, shocking, I know. Everyone is completely unsurprised. What does Glacia start off with? I don't remember. 
She starts off with a Frost Last that has Destiny Bond. Hmm. How do you take out a Frost Last that is going to outspeed everyone on my team that also has Destiny Bond? All I can do is hope for the best. That's all I can do. Because she'll Destiny Bond. She'll probably just spam Destiny Bond. And I don't have anybody I can set up it with. I don't have anybody with Toxic. I don't have anybody with Toxic. Well, this is gonna be fun. All right, I don't, I don't know how this is gonna work out, but yeah, I'm worried, boys. Okay, let's go. Just take care of Glacia, and then we can uh, take out Drake. Hopefully, I don't know. I guess we'll see how that goes. I'm just I'm just a little mad still that I managed to throw as hard as I did. There's no reason for that to have uh, happened. There's no reason for Piece of God to have died. Oh, she starts off with the Auroras. I was wrong. I keep forgetting the Auroras exists. And I still like it. I still like it as a Pokemon, so I don't know what my problem is. Oh, the snow's gonna fuck me up this time around. She has a Jinx, too. I forgot about that. Okay, we're just going to set up. I still don't outspeed the um, the Frostlass. So I'm going to have to be really careful with it. I'm going to have to be careful with how I approach Frostlass. Because it's probably going to come out this turn. I don't have Iron Head on you. I forgot. God damn it. I forgot you don't have for some reason she didn't for some reason slasher didn't learn iron head or any steel type move at all and i don't know how or why so x scissor doesn't kill but it almost does she's gonna heal up this turn so i'm gonna heal up too because of course i get paralyzed ah oh, damn dude okay she does have a wall ran i do remember the wall ran though i'm gonna have to take care of that too now luckily the Jinx and, like, everything but the fro or the Frostlass, Lois can take care of in terms of eating the hits. So we have that going for us, but I don't know. I don't know how this is going to go. Thunderbolt. Go. All right, that's fine. Are you going to heal again? Because I'd prefer you didn't. For another x Scissor. I really don't know what to do about the Frostlass. The Frostlass has me nervous. I could go... Jinx. Okay, Jinx is coming out. Well, I'm going to go into Lois. I'm going to yawn it. That might be ha what I have to do against the Frostlass, is yawn it and then pray that I can kill it before it wakes up. Okay, I'm going to go for the yawn. I can calm mine, too. But this thing has dry skin, so that's going to be annoying. Okay, I'm gonna just Calm Mind. Honestly, Calm Mind could help me. Lefties will also really help me, so... Alright. Just go for the Calm Mind. Just set up on this... Oh, you bitch! You're putting us both to sleep, you cunt! I swear to God. Okay, I just wanted to take on Drake this episode, and, like, I immediately got swept, so... I don't know what to say about it. I don't know, man. But I'm a little disappointed in myself. I mean... We might just beat Glacia and then save Drake for next episode. So then at least we'll have two episodes to end off next week. So then I have more time to work on my layout. Because I'm almost done. I'm getting close to the intro. The intro phase is basically at what I'm at next. So, you know, it's working out. It'll be fine. We'll be fine. What's the worst that could happen? I don't know. I guess we'll figure out. <laughs> I don't know, man. But I just need to take out Glacia. You know, there's physically no way Glacia can hurt me more than she did all of, like, you know, an episode ago. So I guess we'll be fine. What's the worst that could happen? Just collect myself. Try not to cry. Blizzard. All right. Uh, I'm honestly... This game just loves to make me sad. That's just all it does. 
all it does is just it, it like freeze me why <laughs> also i'm pretty sure the hail had already stopped and she managed to hit the bl hit the blizzard while also simultaneously uh f freezing me so you know everything's fine it's okay rng just hates me i'm just gonna keep setting up because at least then i can live um i can i can survive the shadow balls from what's its face that was a crit dude god damn it i can survive the shadow balls from frost Lass. i can put it to sleep and then i can hopefully psychic and or surf it and one shot it but if i want to do that I need to be plus six, so it's gonna take us a little longer. I gotta. I just need this thing to stay asleep for two turns, two more turns, and then we'll be fine. Because this episode does not need to go on any longer than it is. Of course you wake up, of course you lovely kiss me, and of course you hit it. Because why wouldn't you? I don't know, man. This game just makes me so mad. The way things work out. The fact that turn one, that high dragon hit the focus blast and I just watched. I just sat there and watched Steelix get his shit wrecked. There was no reason for that to happen. But of course it did. All right. I'm just going to set up again. Oh my. Dude, Jinx is like making its way. I have always hated Jinx as a Pokemon. Just because its movesets always piss me off. Because they always have Sweet Kiss and Lovely Kiss, and they just sit there, and they spam them, and they land the hits, even though it's 75% accurate. And if it was a Jinx on my team, I'd be missing all of them. But, that aside, everything that's happened between uh, the Fire Red Omega Nuzlocke the first time we went around, and I lost Lanny, up to literally this just 10 seconds ago, with the amount of Lovely Kisses she has landed on me, I'm just, you know, Jinx is just one of those Pokemon that I hate. And I just look at it and I hate it. She's hit all of her lovely kisses. I, if she's missed any, she's missed one. And that's it. She woke up like turn one from Yawn. Which is not a good sign. Because that means, with my luck, the Frostlass will wake up in turn one. But can I just wake up not get hit by lovely kiss let me put you to sleep Dude, i'm gonna like i'm gonna i'm gonna fucking lose my mind this is like and it's like it's just stupid this is the reason i lose mons because i get hit by this rng that like would never work on my side and then i just get to a point where i'm like dude i just want this to be over so i button mash or i use the speed button and i die because of it and then you know bad things happen to me but now I'm going to sit here and probably be asleep for five turns before I wake up. Because what else would I be? I just want to be plus six so I can guarantee that I one-shot um, Frostlass. That's literally all I want. But she's like running out of moves and soon enough she's only going to have Lovely Kiss and she's going to land all of them. She's landed every single one. It's 75% accurate. Miss one, please. I know 75% accurate is more, like a pretty decent chance still. But, come on, dude. I would never hit those. I would never hit them. I just don't know. I just don't know. Like, am I just... Do I just have bad luck? The answer's probably yes. Okay. I just wanna... I just wanna plus six. She's gonna wake up, like, next turn and lovely kiss me again. Just before I can plus six. I literally just need to land one... I just need one more calm mine. It's fast asleep. Okay, fine. That's fine. I'm not even guaranteeing that I kill this thing in one turn, because it's going to resist Psychic either way. And it's at full health. So, woke up, lovely kiss. Oh, there it is, there it is. I've spent, like, ten minutes just fighting this Jinx. Psychic. If she lowers my special defense, I'm going to be so pissed. Okay. Let's just wake up. I'm just going to wait until I wake up, because that's all I can do. She's landed all of her lovely kisses. I don't know what to say about that. I don't. I really don't. But I'm mad. That's all I can say. So I literally just have to sit here and wait until I wake up. And with my luck, either I'll wake up now or I'll wake up in three turns. There we go. Perfect. Psychic. Kill. It doesn't even kill. She's going to lovely kiss me and put me to sleep again. 
and then we're just gonna be stuck in the cycle again. <laughs> I just don't know, dude. I don't. I just don't. She, like, watching her wake up so fast from that yawn and then lovely kissing me is the most aggravating thing ever. So, Lois, please just wake up. Please. Please just wake up this turn. I don't have any early bird mons. So, that's kind of a shame. God, I swallow these attacks, but it doesn't matter because I can't even land a single hit on this fucking thing. Because, like, she's just lovely kissed me every single turn. And she's landed all of them. Like, why? Thank you. Thank you, Lois. I appreciate it. All right. Like, and, and all I'm doing all of this just hoping for the Frostlass to come out. Because the Frostlass might not even come out. It might take forever for the Frostlass to come out. There it is. Okay, fine. You know what? World, prove me wrong. She's going to debond. I'm going to go for the Yawn. Shadow Ball. Okay. I'm going to go for the Yawn right here. I'm going to... She's life orb. I forgot about that. Okay. I'm not going to attack this turn. I'm going to wait just in case she destiny bonds right now. And I'm going to calm mine. Because I don't want to risk the destiny bond. That's literally all there is to it. Okay. Let's just waste some time. Put you to sleep. Now for the uh, main event, which is just surfing you. Goodbye, Frostlass. Get one-shotted. Just get demolished. Thank you. I appreciate it. As soon as the Glalie comes out, however, I'm going to have to skadoodle. But for now, Lois can uh, take care of business. Mammal Swine. I think Lois can take care of business against this thing. I'm going to assume that Lois can take care of business against this thing. Earthquake. I can swallow that. That's fine. Look at that. Ate it up. Absolutely nothing. Mammal Swine, get out of my face. Wall rain is all she has left before the Galili. I don't know what to do against the Galili. I honestly don't. I really don't. Because I honestly think that whatever I get hit with, whatever I get hit with, even with Slasher, will still hurt. So I'm gonna actually take the time to heal now. Oh, you're a bitch. Okay. 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 Uh, who's my? I mean. My other bet is to just go into Bells. I could do that. I could do that, I could Metal Sound and there's Extra Sensory, or... I can, um... Or I can just Gyro Ball and see how much Gyro Ball does, which probably won't be a lot. But... It'll be something. I'm just going for the Psychic. I was going to wait out the Hail, but it's not worth it. So, Psychic will probably one-shot Wall Rain. There it is. That was a crit, too. That crit probably didn't even matter. All right. Um, let's see. Let's see who our bulkiest Mon is for this Glalie. Because, honestly, I think a Head Smash could destroy 218, 286, 230. Okay, no. There's no way a Head Smash will kill Slasher. Like, as powerful as Head Smash is, it's not killing Slasher. So, I mean, dude, a defensive 286 is insane. Then again, I'm mega, so I guess there's that. <laughs> Alright. Alright, Glalie, what you got for me? Hi, Glalie. I, I remember you from the last time. Head smash. Ow! Look at that. I swallowed that. x Scissor. Just damage. Go. Look, this is all I needed to happen last last time around. Was I just, I just needed her to not crit me. That's really all I needed, but you know, this time around this time around we don't have to deal with that. So, x scissor, Head smash. Go for it. Do your worst. And goodbye. Thank you. Thank you for uh, playing. Thank you for this uh, lovely chance to try to make me sad again, but here we are. Alright, look at that. We're fine. We survived. It only took probably, what, 43 minutes of this episode? Which is probably your guys' uh signal that I lost. So, and we came in again and PZ got immediately got destroyed. So, five Pokemon. That's what we have left. But, five Pokemon that can take care of... Hmm. <laughs> can I take care of Fire Blast? You probably, what? Fire Blast, Drago Meteor, 
Night Slash and Focus Blast, that'd probably be the moveset on that High Dragon. So I can go into Paula. I can just Vert Break it with Paula. Draco Meteor's probably gonna wreck my shit. Um, unless I go in with Bells. My special defense is pretty high with Bells, so I can just Confuse Ray it. And then just Gyro Ball it. Or I can go in, hope that I live whatever it throws at me. And then go for a Life Orb Brick Break and hope that it's not enough damage for me to die. I don't know. We're going to see how this goes. But, anywho, we're going to call it an episode, you guys. As we make our way back to where we were at the beginning of, la of the, the episode. So, yeah. Alright. In that case, now we'll have two episodes for next week. And I won't have to start the... Uh, next series as early as I thought we were going to. Gives me more time to work on it, which is fine. I'll always take that. I hope you guys are okay with that. But with that, I'm going to call an episode here, you guys. Thank you all so much for watching. And if you guys enjoyed, make sure you do smash that like button. If you want to see more, make sure you subscribe and get to pause right into that PC party. Share with your friends. Follow me on Twitter at PCBowmaster. Join the Discord. Link is down below. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I am PCBowmaster, and I'll see you guys next time.